increase as we get close to Mother's Day, which is this Sunday. According to the Sacramento Food Bank, one in four children in the city are going hungry. Last year, the nonprofit distributed 31 million meals to those struggling with food insecurity. Now inflation is compounding the problem, and food isn't the only necessity these families need. That's why Assemblymember Kevin McCarty is partnering with the Sac Food Bank to collect baby Let's clothes and strollers and more as part of his 12th annual Mother's Day donation drive. As we celebrate mom by showcasing how she can get some much needed help, Assemblyman McCarthy is here with us live along with Sac Food Bay President and CEO Blake Young. Gentlemen, welcome to Fox 40 News at 11. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Definitely. Yeah. Let's start with you, Assemblyman McCarty. This donation drive ran through the month of April, but there will be a final push this Friday. People can still give. Yeah, well, big picture, we want to celebrate and honor moms. It's been a tough year for moms with COVID, and we always want to honor moms. Uh, the Food Bank is an amazing entity that helps provide food, of course, but also they provide um, parenting classes, supplies for babies and kids. And, you know, my kids are now 13, so for 12 years, we've been hosting this Mother's Day drive, collecting thousands of pounds of um, essentially clothes, you know, mm -hmm. clothes that people don't grow. You know, kids outgrow their clothes, and so what a great place to give it back to the Sacramento Food Bank and baby supplies, and it helps moms in need and really is a way to uplift um, the families here in Sacramento. Blake, how did this partnership between the Food Bank and the Assemblyman come together? Well, I, I think first, you know, my gratitude to, to Kevin and, and his team, and, uh, you know, I think, quite frankly, Kevin's a father of two daughters, and Kevin had wanted to help us even before his daughters were born and and Kevin came up with this idea and I just think first it it, it just shows um, how great of a community leader he is and he and obviously you know that trickles down to how he raises the girls the girls have been involved so what a great teachable moment but uh, you know it was just his interest in helping the community and he's had a he's had a real keen interest in all the activities that we do and ha have been supporting it for years so hats off to Kevin and his family and we, we could not be uh, more grateful for all of his efforts. All righty, Assemblyman. Well, that was uh, quite the rundown right there in the big mm -hmm. thank you. For the families who need this kind of support, did you have to sign up ahead of time? Or are you still taking names? How does the distribution work for people who need this help? Well, I'll let Blake go into greater details, but the food bank and family services provides food, but also they provide a number of resources to families. So you can do appointment based or you can show up there and they help families literally every day of the week. So maybe Mr. Young can explain a bit more. Yeah, thanks, Kevin. I, you know, first of all, we there's a couple ways that the distribution happen. One, one is thanks to all this effort, we can work with other community based organizations mm -hmm. that have clients get in contact with us. We also have a direct distribution emergency program where we help families as well. And I will tell you that the items that uh, Assembly Member McCarty and his team uh, have 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 uh, brought in over the years is, is just been such a tremendous help uh, for folks. And you know, I want to give a shout out to all the donation sites. Uh, Assembly Member McCarty was able to, to to bring together a lot of businesses and organizations that also hosted it. Uh, Fairy Tale Town, Oak Park Community Center, Gunther's Ice Cream, etc. And, you know, that that team effort is what really makes it special. And we're just so grateful. Well, it just really goes to show, as you just highlighted, that survival, making it through this life and thriving is a team sport. So everybody out there who mm -hmm. may know a family that, that needs some of this help, or if you're that family, just contact the food bank, get an appointment, walk in, talk to someone. That help is available to take the pressure off of mom this time of year. She's gearing up for her special day. Gentlemen, thank you so much. Thank you thank so you. much.